balloons and candles, great for birthdays, but they don't really mix unless you are a science guy, Steve Spangler. In today's Science Minute, he's using them as tools to teach us about the science behind thermal energy. Fire and a balloon, never a winning combination unless you have a secret ingredient and that's water. Watch what you do. This time I'm going to use a clear balloon so you can see what's going on. Water is, uh, is great at pulling heat away from something else. And in this particular case, the latex balloon. So watch, I'm going to blow it up like that. See the water sitting on the very bottom there? That is going to be our secret ingredient. So watch what happens. So I put this, the flame in place here. And now take a look at this. The flame is gonna heat up the latex, but the water is gonna pull or absorb that heat away from the latex, pull it away, and through convection, look at this. The flame stays in there, it heats up the water. The water is getting hot, it's churning inside. Look at this, it's completely charred on the bottom there, but the secret was the water is pulling that heat away from the latex until finally, of course, the water would boil and it would pop, but who would have ever thought that you could put a flame in a balloon, the secret being water. That's your Science Minute. I'm Steve Spangler. <laughs> I feel like, well, no. <laughs> just kind of like, I don't call him like a danger to society. He's just always doing things with like no. fire and latex. It's He's, so funny. He makes danger look fun yes. and not so dangerous. And it's like, there's always science behind it. I'll never forget when I was pregnant, he gave me a book. He's like, you're gonna have to do these with your daughter one day. I'm like, oh, one day way in the future. <laughs> we love it. Without any real damage to the house. Yes.